Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I've got a new bag reveal. I actually bought this bag months and months ago. It's just I have been really, really busy at work and I've just really not got round to filming this um, reveal. And also, I really didn't want to use it until I actually did film this reveal video. So I've been so good, actually. It's just been sitting in this dust bag in my bag shelf for months. So finally, here it is. Okay, so just to give you a bit of a backstory, I visited Vista Village Retail Park at the beginning of this year and I did a, I filmed a whole vlog on it so those of you who haven't watched that video I will link it to this video and anyway while I was there I visited Burberry and I saw this bag but at the time I didn't really look at it in detail I literally just kind of filmed um, and that was it so I didn't sort of pay too much attention to it and it wasn't until I came home and doing the editing and, and going through the the footage that i noticed it's a really nice bag why you know i took a couple of photos but then i thought to myself why didn't i look at it in more detail and anyway i just kept thinking and thinking about it so in the end i um went back to vista and uh, it's basically an outlet uh village so I, I went back and some weeks later, and thankfully, you know, it was still there. They had a number of, uh, they had this style in a number of colors. And, uh, and then I tried it on and, and it just looked, I thought it looked really nice. So I made the decision to buy it because I was given some money for Christmas and also uh, my birthday, which I hadn't spent. Um, I, was, I was given money by my family and, uh, and I just c kind of kept it because I didn't really have a chance to, to do much shopping and, and look for something that I wanted to buy for myself. So I decided to use that money to buy this bag, finally. And uh, so here's the reveal. I, um, like I said, I bought it months ago and I've just been so busy that I've not got round to actually filming the reveal. So I have been very good. It's been sitting in this dust bag in my shelf for months and I've not used it at all um, because I've not actually taken it out of the packaging. But also the reason I wanted to buy a Burberry bag was because last year I sold one of my Burberry bags and um, well in fact it was the only one that I had left because I sold another one previous to that and uh, so this last one that I sold was a gorgeous vintage bowling bag which I had bought over 20 years ago from the Bista outlet um, not Bista sorry the Burberry outlet which wasn't in Bista it was somewhere else it was in another town I can't remember I don't think it's even there anymore because it's so long ago and um, so I bought it from that outlet and it was still such a beautiful bag and it was you know in the classic um, Czech print but it's cloth but it had dark brown suede panels on either side with suede uh, handles and it was still in gorgeous condition but over the last few years I hadn't used it very much and I just last year I just made the decision to sell and believe me as soon as I sold it I had real seller's remorse and I've been really upset about it ever since because as soon as I listed it on eBay it literally sold within a day because it, it was still a really really gorgeous bag in excellent condition and I just thought to myself why the heck did I sell it <laughs> it was and I've just been really quite upset ever since so since last year I wanted to buy um, another Burberry bag just to kind of round off my collection so when I saw this particular bag I thought that's really cute I wanted a nice um, casual Burberry bag just to um, wear with you know casual outfits and I actually did want a bucket bag and I really really like the style of uh, Louis Vuitton uh, Neo Noé 
but I didn't want to spend that kind of money on another casual bag because I do actually have a lot of casual bags so when I saw this Burberry one um, at the outlet I thought price wise it's very reasonable and since I had money from uh, Christmas and my birthday anyway um, then I may as well choose something that I really liked so here it is guys okay so it comes in the Burberry dust bag Ta -da! so it's a cute little bucket bag with red leather strap and you can see it's got the Burberry logo printed on there you've got the check and it's got magnetic closure let me just take this stuffing out it's just the uh, care card yeah so it's just got ma magnetic closure and this was actually reduced this is actually called Lorna I think poppy red and it was reduced from 595 down to 416 and then further reduced to 395 oh so you can't you can't see it there but um I'll, I'll put it in the description box anyway so it's 395 pounds reduced down to 595 so that's really i think not bad at all um let me just open the straps so I can put it on for you um, and I really like oh dear let me just take out this it's actually taped on really tightly but anyway I can show you here this tag it's you've got the Burberry on one side and then you've got the check print on the other so that's quite nice but it's, it's actually sellotaped on so I will need to cut that off and um, okay let me just quickly slice this open just trying to be careful not to uh, cut into the strap as well and the good thing is the strap is actually adjustable as you can see so I think it's really nice so this bag it actually comes in three no sorry four uh, colors you've either got the um, red leather outside with the check interior and or uh, pink sort of like baby pink or you can choose uh, this check exterior with pink on the inside and I tried both actually and I think all the SAs there agreed with me that as soon as I put this one on they just said yeah this is the one it really suits you so hold on. wear my uh, Gucci belt to go with it so you can see I do like a pop of red and I just think it's really cute it's a really good length as well it just sits quite nicely but like I said it's also adjustable so I can have it higher if I wanted to but I think I quite like crossbody in the, this length and I just really like the pop of red against it and you know what? I've got my Burberry card holder, which goes perfectly. So yeah, I just think it's really, it's really cute. Um, it's a really good size as well. So obviously with bucket bags, you can fit loads of things in there. Um, and it's quite easy to get in and out of. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really happy with this. taken all the plastic off now so just to give you a closer look and it's got this beautiful leather base and the tag 
which you can show either side and the beautiful red leather interior. So yeah, I'm really happy with this. And um, so yes, I think this has now just satisfied my Burberry craving. <laughs> um, although, you know, I still think about the bag that I sold previously and, uh, and that really is a lesson learned for me that unless I am 100% certain uh, that I'm not going to have any regrets, um, then I should really hold on to the bag and not make any sort of brash decisions in selling. So, but at least now I have got this, which I am very happy with, and uh, I'm sure I will get a lot of use out of it. So I'm very thankful to my family for my um, Christmas and birthday money to be able to buy this. So there you have it. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If so, please give me a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, then please do consider subscribing to see what else I get up to. So until next time, please take care and don't forget to smile. Bye-bye.